So Dizzy called George Ween, who organizes all the big jazz festivals in the world, and he called me. And I was back in Europe for the first time since I was a boy. I arrived at The Hague in Holland for the North Sea Jazz Festival, and there was all these old friends. Some of them I haven't seen for years. Since I was a little boy, okay. I with Ben Webster and Don Bias and Leslie on 52nd Street, just before it finished. When you were there right. all the time, right, right. And you remember when I was a little kid yeah. drinking in those yeah. clubs. Yeah, he could have been from the Onyx Club, That's the right. famous door. But old Valley, what about those five weeks in Birdland? Do you remember that? <laughs> <laughs> the real Irene, he pushed the chair through the ceiling. <laughs> you was playing. When I was plowing, so. okay. <laughs> Flat foot Fluji with the floor of joy. Unimo. Artissimo. It's pleasure to see you. You are eternal. <laughs> you know, this man is one of the great originals, you know. Uh, uh, McVoughty here, and oh, he, he created his own language, his own structure of music, and at one time was really a major influence on everything that was happening in jazz. So let me talk about you for a minute. Shut up for a minute and stop talking, and let me tell how great Slim Gaylord is and was. Because uh, when I was a young fellow, I mean, just a boy, I used to listen to Slim Gaylord, Slim and Slam's records. We buried poor slam past this past year he, he was my bass player you know, and i talked to him just before yes. go ahead i'm and listening was, uh, but slim set a style and a tone and a structure that all jazz musicians followed there just was something that that infiltrated the whole meaning of the language of the jazz musicians it affected the playing it affected the showmanship it affected the projection and the ideas what a speech i thank you very much for your nice thoughts and the way you speak and saying nice things about me Coming from you, with you in contact with the top musicians of the world, which all were little children when I was doing my jazz thing. That's true, you know? yes. But uh, you got the champions with you, and you can't do anything but well because you have an ear for music, have a knowledge of music, and a bit with I don't need to tell you. I have a love for music, yeah, and that's probably. what's directed that's me That's your all vegetable. My life. That's what's kept me going. And all that's my, life. my favorite vegetable is music. I love it, and it keeps growing and growing and growing. But and I, I don't eat see. just vegetables. Oh, you so don't? Jazz is my meat and my sustenance. And oh, okay. Ice cream, everything. You see. <laughs> You're not so, a vegetarian. No, I'm not a vegetarian. You're a meatarian. Oh, Lord, save me from vegetarians. Oh, yeah? I, I have friends that invite me to their houses and they're vegetarians and they're afraid I won't have enough to eat. And they feed me so much food. I, I never eat so much in my life as when I go to a vegetarian's house to eat. Well, I, why I say I'm a vegetarian? Because I eat steaks, you know? And the cows eat vegetable. I see. Uh, now, I, now that's that's my slim game. <laughs>